friends, thanks for joining me. Today I am doing my project share with the items that I received from my last BB Craft order. If you would like to participate in the BB Craft YouTube program, you just need 100 subscribers and you will need to make three videos. Your first video will be an unboxing of the products that you receive, and your next two videos will be project shares using the items that you receive. If you'd like more information, you can click on the link in my description box, and it will take you to their website and you can fill out the form. Here is the complete set that was sent to me by BB Craft, and it is enough to make six keychains with three charms on each keychain. For this project, I have decided to use the little mini notepad that says I love you and it's got like a letter on the next page. I'm going to use the pink donut and lastly I'm going to use one of the wings. The kit came with a little bag of O-rings and so I'm going to use three of those as well. So I'm going to grab my needle nose pliers and I will open the O-ring using them. I will then hook on the charm and then I will hook that to the keychain. That part is finished. Now we're gonna have some fun and we are going to add this to a tassel and this tassel is actually gonna end up going on a junk journal that I've recently created. Before we attach the keychain to the tassel, I'm going to use some of the pink satin ribbon also that I got from BB Craft and I'm going to add a few pieces. I think I'm gonna add three pieces of that to the keychain. Before we add this keychain to our tassel, I'm going to trim the ends of the ribbon here, and I always like to cut the ends of the ribbon at an angle. I think this is looking pretty cute. Now I'm going to attach it to this pretty tassel, and this project will be all done. I'm going to use the other keychain kit to make another tassel. So the first thing I'm doing is I have an old sheet and I am tearing that into strips. And now I'm cutting some of the satin ribbon that I got from BB Craft. I'm going to use the dark blue, the light blue, and then also a few strands of the cream colored. I also have some gold tulle with some gold sparkles on it and I'm going to use that to kind of signify the sand. This is going to be a nautical themed or a beach themed tassel. I think some jute cord would be kind of cool in this as well. I have everything cut and now I am ready to kind of put my layers together if you will for my tassel. This is now ready to be put through the o-ring of the keychain. I'm going to use some clothes pins to hold the material together and then I will just start pushing it through the o-ring. Once I get it centered, I will remove the clothes pins. I just use those kind of for some stability and to keep the the ribbons and things from shifting around. Now you'll see I'll begin pulling it down and pulling it tight because now it's time for me to wrap a ribbon around it and then tie it. Now it's time to trim the bottom. I don't make everything perfectly even. I kind of like it a little bit shabby, but I, I don't want you know any major stragglers or anything. And of course, I always cut the ribbon at an angle. Now I'm going to use my needle nose pliers and I'm going to open up an o-ring and then attach the charm to it and then I will attach that to the keychain. I'm going to attach the starfish now but I'm going to go ahead and use some of the cream colored satin ribbon that I received in my BB Craft order. I'm choosing to use the satin ribbon because I want this piece to hang below the locket. I will put the links for all of the items that I use in these projects in my description box below. If 
we are going to begin our second tassel. I had some material hanging around, it used to be my daughter's curtains, and it's this orange and green and yellow satin material. So I went ahead and I cut it into strips. I actually tore it because I wanted it to have some raggedy edges. I'm going to be using orange and kind of this yellow green ribbon from my BB Craft ribbon pack that I received. Once I add the ribbon to the fabric bundle, we will prepare to push it through the O-ring on the keychain. Once that is done, I will use some ribbon to tie around the top and that will keep all of the pieces of fabric in place. And now I'm going to add the charms I have chosen the very large owl charm and then also one of the lockets. I would like the locket to hang lower than the owl on this tassel, so I have opted to use one o-ring and then I'm threading some satin ribbon through the o-ring and then I will attach that to the keychain. If you have enjoyed this video, smash that like button. And why not help me get to 500 and subscribe? I hope you enjoyed watching me create these projects with all the BB Craft goodies that I received. Thanks for watching. See you soon.